Hey everyone, welcome to today's workout. Thursday, March 19. Our warm up starts with three rounds of 10 shoulder circles, and we're building on these. So, getting into a nice large shoulder circle progressively, um, and then moving into the floor touches and back bend. So, notice Diego's going down into a squat. Keeping his back nice and neutral, touching the ground, and then extending his spine, opening up his shoulders, hips, and, uh, and really reaching back there, trying to create a nice arc with his body. Next, he'll move into the alternating Spider-Mans. Notice how he's in a really long lunge position at the bottom, and his elbows Kilo. is uh, reaching down towards his instep, closest to his foot. He's alternating there. Good job. Next, we'll move into the workout. It's uh, two cycles of eight minutes each. And it starts with plank to push-ups. Now, this is um, a skill that you can do if you don't have a regular push-up. Diego's going to show us now um, a regular full push-up. So getting his chest down as close to the ground as he can and going into a nice lockout while keeping his back straight. That's a scale up. Next, he'll move into the alternating lunges. We did these uh, yesterday, but our focus is a little bit more on the glutes this week, so we are hitting these again. And uh, scaling up, we're gonna be adding some weight. So Diego's gonna take a kettlebell and then hold it in that goblet squat position and then continue those lunges. So this is a scale up if you already have the alternating lunges body weight you can make this a little more challenging by increasing the load on these guys next uh, Diego is going to go into the sit up so here are the butterfly sit ups notice he's getting his hands down shoulders to the ground and then coming all the way up to 90 degrees and touching the ground in front of him so he's getting full range of motion here activating his entire abdominal walls and uh, now going into the leg raise. So you want to try to keep your back as neutral as possible and keep that lower back in contact with the ground while still maintaining your legs nice and straight. So notice how Diego is getting almost his heels down to the ground. They're just hovering a few inches and then really creating um, full range of motion with those leg raises. And next he'll go into the Russian twist. These are unweighted. So you'll see his feet are off the ground and he's rotating from left to right. That's going to equal one rep. We can add a weight implement. So he's going to use a medicine ball here just to make it a little bit more demanding on the trunk. So you can also do that and add some weight, whatever you have at home now. Oh, there's Kilo. Kilo needed his 10 seconds of fame. So we have to give it to him. Um, we did him better. We gave Stay. him a little bit more time here on camera. Stay. And he did such a good job that uh, we just had to get him on. Good job, Kilo. Kilo's my dog. Oh, and okay, He comes to the gym okay, as much boy. as I can bring him. So he, he was loving it. Next is uh, three rounds of flow. This is just kind of a cool down. We're going to do five to ten seconds of the downward dog. And then go into the tall plank. Hold that. Then go into the chaturanga, which is a nice slow lower into that bottom of the push-up and then an upward facing dog next to just move into the alternating Samson stretch which Diego is doing so um, on the creative flow just kind of transition into each movement don't pause just make it flow nice and smooth